I want you guys to, uh, we're just gonna change the term, but it's not gonna change anything in terms of attitude and the way you're working with each other, okay? okay. Uh, there's this idea of opposition and touching and not being touched, no matter what you do. Keep this in mind, no matter what you do, you wanna touch and you don't wanna be touched, okay? Um, so, Stevie's gonna punch, but you can punch some stuff, right? And I'm gonna kick every now and then. <laughs> no. And uh, do I have to wait until he stop? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, but I'm not going to be on the offense. Okay. Sir. He, I I have to wait until he starts initiating. And it's the same thing before. It's before the first, the second, the third. You don't know how long the combo is going to be. Uh, you don't know if he's going to fire three or four or ten punches. If you have an opportunity to fire ten punches in a row, should you? Yes. Yes. Well, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> why stopping? If your partner is not stopping you, the only thing I can stop is yourself. So why? Why? No, 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 absolutely not. Okay, you have the advantage, you find your openings. You, I mean, you work too hard to create those openings without taking the opportunity to use them. Okay? So number one, punches. Number two, keep the hands up. Okay? You know, those punches are going to come to the head most of the time. Um, and, uh, and then you get your kicks in. Sounds good?